All right, so we're getting a trade here from Jackie, who is offering up a Halloween Evil Dash Town. It isn't that great, actually. I actually would have thought that it would have been a lot more better, but it's not. <laughs> it's like about 10% of the value of a Mega Ship in you for some reason. <laughs> and she is putting up an ice cream cone, two ice cream cones, three ice cream cones, four ice cream cones. What is going on? Also, it looks like two pizzas three four pizzas but yeah this this just isn't gonna be good all right so we're getting a trade from this guy here who is offering up a neon hydra these pets are actually pretty cool i'm sorry not a neon hydra what i'm talking about it's a neon wavern and these are actually really cool because their wings like spread out really really far out so they're like really huge uh but it's really not that good compared to a mega shiba inu it's about 40 percent of the value of a mega so that he would still need to add i don't think he's going to oh so he removed it for a shrew which the shrew is a far Far less valuable than a wavern oof yeah the shrew's only about 30 percent of the value so yeah that's not gonna be that good so we're getting a trade here from drift 67 who's offering up a fly potion and a ride potion yeah i really wouldn't consider that too great because you can just buy them yourself all right so we're getting a trade from this person who is offering up a rideable golden penguin and then a king penguin as well i wonder if those are still inside of the game or not it would be right there where that ice cream cone is at i have not even check anyways that he's that's it that's that's all he's offering <laughs> just these two pets so yeah that's not gonna be that great okay so girls 11 quad here is offering up a neon husky so that's about i want to say like 60 percent of the value of the mega shiba in you so she's getting there but it doesn't look like she's gonna be adding anything else so we're just gonna go ahead and decline but maybe if she added something that was about 30 to 40 percent of the value probably would have been worth it all right so we got another trade here from this person who's offering up an otter you guys already know those aren't really that valuable come on Cat's really not that great either. Sandwich and a baby bottle. Yeah, this isn't good whatsoever. All right, so this guy here wants to offer up for my Mega Frost Dragon. So it looks like he's offering up a Neon Subarus a neon cobra a neon dragon looks like three neon kitsunes wow one more and you can literally have omega a rhino and then a rib cage carriage and a magic house door this thing actually would be pretty cool nevertheless i don't really think it's going to be worth it for especially for a mega frost fury for the majority of these pets okay so this guy here wants to also offer up for my mega frost fury but he's just putting up an one evil unicorn so that's not going to be too great all right so this person here wants to offer up for my mega cow so we're gonna go ahead and give her the chance so she's starting out with a neon donkey and then a neon ant a neon poodle a neon zebra and a neon camel these are all from the new egg and then we also have a t-rex a dragonfly and a neon husky and then following up with a kitsune yeah i i don't think this is going to be that great the majority of these pets are newer pets anyways that are just dropping in value oof really the only one that i would consider somewhat valuable would be these three right here and that's only because this t-rex is no longer inside of the game so that one's somewhat valuable this kitsune is well i guess it's a little bit valuable but not that not too great and then the neon husky is pretty cool this other stuff is pretty fairly new so it's still gonna drop in value unfortunately okay so this guy here is offering up a neon monkey for my mega shiba inu and he's also putting up a mega chocolate labrador whoa come to think of it i don't think i've ever seen a mega chocolate labrador like actually out i wonder what the colors on it look like and he's offering up a wood egg which really isn't that great a zodiac minion chick also really isn't too great and four ribbon seals and then wow another neon chocolate labrador wow okay so anyways this is actually well not a win but it is a fair trade because just because of the neon monkey the cho the mega chocolate labrador and the neon chocolate labrador the rest of this stuff is pretty well not that valuable okay so this person here is offering up a diamond dragon which is about for i want well about like 30 to 40 percent of the value of the mega shiba inu and i don't know whether or not he's going to add so we're just gonna go ahead and decline for now okay so we got a trade here from dragon underscore trooper who is putting up a neon cat and a neon wolperting so i already know that the neon cat's not gonna be that great i don't really know about the wolperting right now so i i'm gonna look it up i mean considering it is a neon version yeah actually it wasn't even worth <laughs> looking it up it's only about 20 percent of the value of the mega shiba inu okay we're gonna 
a trade here from Fortnite who is offering up a ninja monkey. I know I got one of my own as well, but up against a Shiba Inu, it is only about 45% of the value of it. So that's not going to be too great. All right. So this person here is offering up a mega chocolate Labrador, a neon monkey, woodland egg, zodiac minion chick. I think we've already traded this person before. And it looks like they're putting up the exact same offer. Oh, they didn't put up the neon chocolate Labrador. This time it is a neon, or I'm sorry, just a normal red panda. But yeah, that's not really going to be that great. All right. So we got a trade here from Jared Bed Wars, one, two, three, four, who's offering up a dragonfly, a ginger cat, a flower mirror chew toy. How can a mirror be a chew toy? <laughs> what? And then they're also putting up some steel drums and a mushroom friend plushie. That actually looks really, really cool. I'm not going to lie. However, this trade really isn't that valuable. Okay. So we got a trade here from Sandy Beach 2022, who's putting up a neon metal ox, which is about like 60% of the value of the mega Shiba Inu. So this person would still need to add, but it doesn't look like they're going to. All right. We're getting a trade here from Sandy Beach 2020, who's putting up a frost dragon. She, by the way, is offering up for my neon frost dragon, a neon metal ox, a frost fury, and a tan chow chow. These pets look so cool. But yeah, this isn't really that valuable to me. These metal oxes are really not that crazy in value. And a frost fury isn't really that good for me. I mean, I've already got a mega one anyways. She is also putting up a giant black scarab, a donkey, a bullfrog, an ant, and finishing it up with a neon walrus. She did remove the um, the frost fairy, but yeah, this isn't really that great. All right, we're getting a trade here from this person who is putting up a neon dodo. Looks like a rideable Dalmatian, a neon gold horn. Wow, that's a pretty valuable pet. Neon Dodo is valuable too, but really not that valuable for some reason. I don't know why. These used to be really, really valuable back in the day. Anyways, and then also a rideable Dalmatian, a neon guardian lion, ooh, a crocodile, a neon chicken. That's really cool. I actually have one neon chicken. I need three more to make a mega. And then a neon black panther and a shrew. All right, we're getting a trade here from Batty underscore, looks like Mia2021, who is putting up a neon Wolperting, which I think I said before that these were going for about... I think I said they were 25% or something like that. Maybe I'm wrong. And then a neon B, but the neon B, well, maybe with the neon B, it probably may be worth it. Let's find out. I thought it was going to, but it really isn't. It really is only about like 60% of the value or so. And she literally just declined it. Anyway, so we're getting another trade here from DDKKDKFJ, who is putting up a neon turtle. Those are actually pretty valuable. By the way, I actually do need a neon turtle. And then also a, a farm egg. Looks like now they're going to be putting up candy corn a galaxy explorer helmet and then a lunar rattle a snowball launcher yeah this isn't really that great it's really only great because of the neon turtle 